critical role in any continuous improvement effort is supporting improvement projects and participating as a team member on projects led by green belts and black belts. These projects are typically large in scope, are cross-functional and have an unknown root cause. This module is about preparing you to be a strong and competent team member. You'll learn the objectives of each phase and will be exposed to the main tools or methods used in each. When you do participate in a larger improvement project, you'll have a greater understanding of the flow of the project and you'll be a very valuable asset to the team. DMAIC is an acronym that stands for the Phases of a Root Cause Analysis Improvement Project. The phases are Define, Measure, Analyze, Improve, and Control. In this section of the training, we'll dive into each phase and share with you the purpose and main milestones of each. Let's go through the phases of DMAIC, getting to the heart of an improvement project. The DMAIC cycle is based upon a method that comes from biology and other sciences. This method is called the scientific method. The scientific method has five basic steps plus a feedback or learning step. The scientific method is the only way to ensure that we learn from our experiences. These steps are firstly make an observation, then ask a question, form a hypothesis, an explanation that can be tested, make a prediction, test that prediction, and use the results to make a new hypothesis or prediction. The scientific method provides the discipline to avoid making decisions based upon gut feel or best guesses. It facilitates decisions and solutions based upon data and actual observations. Each phase has a specific purpose and the milestones of each phase must be completed before jumping ahead to the next phase. When a team believes that they have achieved the milestones of a phase, they arrange a meeting with the project sponsor to ensure that they're on track and that the project sponsor is in alignment with their decisions. These meetings are called toll gate meetings and are a really important mechanism for the team to stay aligned with the leaders of the business and to ensure that their efforts are not wasted. The attendees of the toll gate meeting are the team members and the sponsor. The team may decide to include subject matter experts or other team contributors for particular phases of the project, but the team and sponsor are the key participants. The possible outcomes of the Tollgate meeting depend on the alignment of the team with the sponsor. The sponsor may ask the team to increase their scope or to collect additional data or do further analysis. The team may have gone in a different direction that's not aligned with the organization. The outcomes might be that the project is deemed to be on track and that the team can proceed to the next phase, or it might be paused for more work to be done before the phase is considered complete.